I don't draw ponies. At least, not that much. So how good of a pony can I draw in five minutes? Probably not that good, but we'll see. This is sort of a trial to establish a sense of the relation between the value of art and the time required to get a good result. In other words, I know I'm not going to get very far, so I'm only planning to draw a headshot, and I'm not going to even try to color. Without doubt, many people would be able to get a much fuller result than I with only five minutes, but think about how much practice is needed to get to that point. And even still, there's often some anatomy study that needs to be done during the drawing process to figure out difficult angles. Although I don't draw much, I'm pretty familiar with equine anatomy as a multi-decade pony enthusiast and equestrian myself. And I've extensively studied the profile view of pony heads for non-drawing reasons, which I'll get to in a bit. So because of that, I don't need to rely on references very much while drawing this, which is good because I don't have a lot of time. I've also optimized my setup to the fullest extent I could think of to try to avoid pausing my drawing process for things like switching tools. I guess this is technically a real-time speed paint, except that I'm not painting, I'm sketching. Instead of speeding up the rate of the video, I'm speeding up the drawing rate of my hand. Anyway, so with the generic stuff out of the way, let me talk to you about the specifics of what I've done so far. I don't really like the way that the pony's heads are drawn in FIM. I get that the style is going for a cute vibe by making the eyes gigantic and the mandibles very flat, but I feel that it is too exaggerated, and I like to draw somewhat closer to the shape of a real equine. I spent the entire first minute on basically trying to mentally solve an average between the profile of a real equine and one from Generation 4. Certainly, taking styles from previous generations of MLP into consideration while doing so. I suppose that essentially nullifies a significant portion of the utility of my study on pony anatomy in this context, because it would probably come a lot more naturally for me if I spent more time studying this hybrid amalgamation style of fictional cartoon drawings and reality instead of studying them individually. Anyway, now I'm moving the pony's eye forward a bit because I feel that it was slightly too far back. That's better. Now I'm just going to draw some ears. And a mane, and I guess this is going to be Twilight Sparkle because I'm more used to drawing her than other mares. Give her a nice bulky horsey neck. By the way, if you're an artist or just a person who enjoys drawing pony art, I challenge you to draw a pony in five minutes and see what you can get done. More obsessive compulsive disorder main stuff. So I'm actually recording this voiceover after performing the challenge. It feels strange commenting on my drawing process retrospectively because I'm trying to tie my comments around what's happening on the screen instead of editing the video around my voice narration. Although there's really nothing interesting happening right now, which is why I took the moment to bring it up. and the bottom part of the mane. And I guess she's gonna need a horn unless this is that scene from Discord's Labyrinth. Anyway, not too bad so far. I'm going to erase the edge of her head to connect it to her neck while leaving some of the line at the bottom for some Chad Ramos definition. I guess some of her mane should be snug and cozy against her face, so I'm going to do that. Uh, also, I gotta fix that bite before I run out of time. I've only got a minute left here, and I haven't even finished cleaning the layers up. Let me redraw this a little better. It needs to look about 20% better. Alright, now I somehow have to clear out the rest of the layered lines. There isn't enough time though. Now right here the UI stopped responding to my touch gestures. I kept trying to zoom out but it wasn't working for some reason so I lost about 6 seconds which is kinda a big deal here but never mind I need to add the stripes to the main to make this actually look like Twilight. Go, 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 go! 
Ugh, too tartarous with that timer, I'm not done! Oh well. I would have liked to have been able to fix the clipping behind her ear and draw her mane and neck a little better, but there's only so much you can get done in five minutes. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to see me try to finish this drawing, and maybe I can work on it for another five minutes and make a ten minute pony challenge video. And remember guys, ponies are ponies.